What's up guys, it's Jeremy with Jeremy Lou Photography. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Um, I get a lot of questions on just my daily routine, so I started to start shooting a little bit of these like mini videos, if you will. So this video will be super quick. This video is all about what I take to each portrait session that I shoot. If you've seen me out and about, you know that I wear a bag and I have my camera, but I keep it very, very minimal when I do a lot of my natural light shoots. So uh, let's talk about what I bring right now. What's going on guys? Thank you so much for tuning in again. Um, if you guys are new to the channel, please consider subscribing. If this video helps you out in any way, give it a thumbs up and then click that bell for notifications and you'll know every time I upload a video. But also comment below guys. Let me know if you have any questions, anything that I talk about and then we'll just kind of go from there. So I, um, I'm a big gear whore. I'm allowed to say that. I'm a, I love gear. I love, I love buying things. I love cool new things. So um, whenever I do a portrait shoot, um, I always take my truck and I always have all of my gear in a bag and I kind of lock it in the back. Um, when I actually do a shoot, then I kind of unload it into what I need so I can walk around and actually do the shoot. I don't take my whole gear set with me because I don't need everything based on that shoot. So this is going to be for all my natural light, family portrait shoots, headshots for models, um, um, and anything that I need that's just natural light throughout the day. So no strobes, no flash, anything like that. This is what I bring. So we're going to start with our... Peak design, and this is actually the version two bag that I carry with me. This thing is awesome. I've done a full review on it, so I'll scour my page for this. Basically, it just kind of locks up, and I get to house everything in here. I use this basically just as a lens bag to throw extra lenses on, so when I'm shooting, I don't have to reach for my lenses uh, or or put my whole camera down or or big two bodies or anything. So I have multiple lenses on here. So my camera's right here. I use a 5D Mark IV. I have a spider hand strap. Um, I have a spider uh, holster system. I use spiderholster.com. I'm not wearing it on me right now, but this will sit on my hip. And so I've gone to spider holster instead of a uh, capture clip. And I did a video on that. You guys can check that out as well. But this is kind of my main go-to. So what I do is I always have a lens on this when I come out. I put a SD card and a compact flash card in there. Oh, we've got to, this is my habit of blowing the lenses. So this is kind of what I go to shoot with. Now, I leave two other lenses in here only. I think I'll put this like right her, right there. I'm using the hood of my truck. <laughs> um, I use a Sigma 50. This is a Sigma 35 Art. And a Sigma uh, 85. These are my trifecta of lenses, if you will, the three amigos, the go-to lenses that I use. Um, these are my favorite lenses. I love the art. I, I have three or four other lenses in my bag that I bring maybe on occasion, especially with a wide angle lens. But the 85 is my portrait lens, amazing bokeh. The 50 is my, what I like to see the most natural, maybe headshots, maybe glamour shots. And my 35 is gonna be on my camera the most. And it's for all of my lifestyle shots creative shots maybe i want to get further back and grab a wider shot or i want to get closer in and grab a wider shot so these are my trifecta of lenses this is what sits in my bag after every, or during every shoot what else do i have in this bag i have sd cards on the little clippy on the side here i have compact flash cards because my camera takes both so i always have both with me um, always have it. I usually throw a set of batteries in here for my camera depending on if it's a first or last shoot of the day just so i have it and then what else is in this bag? Because while we're here, we're talking about it. But this is basically it. So I have a few other things that I have to house in this bag as well. Uh, permits. I have a Sand Harbor permit for Lake Tahoe. I have a Rancho San Rafael permit. I have a few filters in here just that I never use. It just sits in here. There's all these cool little contraptions. I have a prism. If you guys don't know what a prism does, this is what it does while you're shooting. Hey, I'm on both sides. Epic, right? So putting this in your lens to create kind of different bokeh. Really cool things. In my little zippy zip pouch, some extra batteries, some eye drops, a, a uh, little battery for my phone here just in case it goes down, a bunch of pens, some cleaning things. Uh, I got this at a little trade show. It's a fidget spinner, but also 
a beer opener. Hmm. Why not? Why not? Business cards, of course, business cards that I never hand out. Uh, I'm horrible at handing out business cards, guys. But that's it. This is kind of my go-to, guys. Everything just kind of gets tossed into here while I shoot. Um, also, I do not put the backs of my uh, these little caps on it while I'm shooting. It's easier for me just to take it off and pull it on, clean it off. When I store it in my, my, uh, my low pro, my big bag, that's when I start to do that. But that's it, guys. A little quick video on what I bring. If you guys see me out and about, these are probably going to be the items that I'm carrying with me with any shoot. And with these, I can do any shoot to natural light during the day and create amazing, epic, fun images. I have to throw a shout out to Sigma Art Series because they are freaking amazing and they created these lenses which made me sell all my Prime L Series lenses to get these and my images are way better and almost changed my uh, my photography thinking completely. So Canon, just up your shit, dude. Just just get better at providing amazing lenses and, and you know, you have the third party that's coming out and I just, I can't justify paying a, you know, I don't know, I'm getting this rant. It's just, you know, I don't wanna pay for your name. That's it. Um, do amazing things. But thank you guys so much again for tuning in. Uh, comment below. I'll talk to you guys later. I gotta go. Bye.